Hello everyone, and welcome to another Coding Fundamentals and GML tutorial. My name is Sam Spade, and in this tutorial, we're going to be talking about repeat loops. A repeat loop is GML's simplest loop. It simply repeats the code inside the loop as many times as you specify. And you can specify that amount with a number or an expression. The form of the repeat loop looks like this. You say repeat, then the number or expression, and then your code. To give some concrete examples, you can say repeat five. This will repeat the show debug message, hello world, five times. You could also give it a function that returns a number. In this case, irandomRange one comma five is a function that will return a whole number between one and five, including five. And then the repeat loop will repeat this code that many times. Now let's switch over to GameMaker Studio 2 and see a couple of examples in the debugger. I've already run the program and the debugger has stopped at the breakpoint. In this first example, we're simply giving the repeat function a number and it's going to repeat this code three times. Hello world, hello world, hello world. Next, we're gonna set up a variable that equals three and we're gonna use that variable to run the repeat loop. So we have number equals three and then repeat number, where again, this will evaluate to three. Notice that number equals three. Now we're gonna print hello world once. We're gonna print number and we're going to decrement the number. That means reduce it by one. Three, hello world, and three. Hello world, two. Hello world, one. An important thing to know about the repeat loop is that this line right here, the, re the repeat, is evaluated at the start and it doesn't change the number of loops if you change that variable later. So even though I was changing the value of the number variable, the number of times the repeat loop looped did not change. For the last demonstration, we're simply going to give repeat the random function, picking between one and three. And in this case, it's pick three. Hello world, hello world, hello world. And that's it. In summary then, a repeat loop simply repeats your code some number of times, and you can specify that number in a variety of different ways. One nice thing about the repeat loop is that there's no possibility of an endless loop, because again, you have to specify a number, and it will only run that amount of times. As always, the links in this slide, as well as a link to the slides themselves and the source code, will be below. And that's it. Thanks for watching. 